my tattoos, everything is symmetrical. So I have both my wrists, both my forearms, and then my uh, bicep on both sides. This one was the first one. Uh, it says GFC, and it stands for Get Fresh Crew. My mom used to call me and my sisters the Get Fresh Crew. And then also, uh, my sister name is Gigi, my mom name is Felicia, and my other sister name is Charmaine. Had you always kind of thought that was, I want to get this one? All growing up, me and my sister say, okay, we're going to get this tattoo, we're going to get this tattoo. And uh, we was originally supposed to get it in baby blocks. But since I was the first one to get it, I just got it on my wrist and just got it done. And they have still yet to get theirs. And it's been four years now. So I'm still working with them to try to get theirs. But I mean, they have tattoos, they just don't have this one yet. When you made the decision to come to Louisville, was it a little bit hard? It sounds like you're pretty tight with your family. Yeah, of course, it was hard. Uh, I, I could have stayed at and went, uh, went to Florida State. But I knew that I wanted to grow up and uh, have myself to depend on, not always depend on my parents. So I knew I needed to get away from home, but close enough where they could get to me, but also further enough to where I could just focus on myself too. Do you feel like you've grown? Definitely. Uh, I think I've matured a lot since my freshman year, um, not just on the basketball court, but my personality has changed. Uh, just matured as a woman too, being here, uh, learning how to do stuff on my own and things like that. You're involved quite a bit in a lot of student athlete organizations and you hosted the award show and things like that. Why get involved with all those things? I don't know, I'm just a really outgoing person. I don't like to sit in the back of the crowd and just like not say nothing. I'll, I'll be that person that sits in the front, always asks questions and stuff like that. It's a little bit of a different season for you guys this year. You know, you had Asia last year and you could. she was such a component of the team. But this, I mean, you've had to step up, Dana's had to step up and kind of figure out the pieces of this team. What was the challenge so far in this season? It was difficult because we had a lot of new people coming in and trying to teach the freshmen and the transfers our system. Um, so it was a learning curve. And then me and Dana stepping into two new different ro roles this year as the as the captains and as the leaders on this team and taking more of a scoring lo load than we had to do last year. So it was a bit of a, 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 a nice change for us, but I think me and Dana have adapted, but we also can't get too comfortable to where everything just seems steady. We have to keep our foot on the gas pedal and continue to lead this team to, uh, to where we can get to. Actually, that's tattoos. Could you see yourself ever getting one for an accomplishment for the team if you guys want to, you know, let's say a national championship? If we if we win a national championship this year, I will get it tattooed on me, most definitely. I will definitely have that happen. 